Hi everyone, welcome back to Decorate with Dana. Um, today's video, I thought that we would go shopping at Walmart. I've seen a lot, of, I've seen some of these shop with me at Walmart, and they seem to be getting a lot of pretty good stuff, especially like home decor. Um, so I want to kind of check it out, see what kind of farmhouse, traditional home decor they have, as well as um, maybe some spring items that they have out. So I thought that I would bring you guys shopping along with me there. And then um, I'm going to head over to Kohl's and same thing. I want to check out their home decor as well as um, their spring decor. So let's go shopping. And if at the end, if I find anything or if I purchase anything, um, I will be happy to share that with you guys. I'm not really looking for a ton. I do want to do a guest bedroom refresh. And if you guys saw my master bedroom kind of makeover, budget makeover, I am still looking for some lamps and something to hang over the bed. So, you know, we'll check out and see what they have. So let's go shopping and I'll check in with you guys at the end. Walmart had a lot of really nice home organization items. They had these knit baskets, um, closet organizers, bins, and baskets, and really at very good prices. So this would definitely be a place to look if you're looking at some items for home organization. I loved these adorable Pioneer Woman Instant Pots. The de design and pattern on them were so cheerful and fun for $99. I love my Instant Pot. Uh, mine is just the regular silver one, but had I seen this one, I would have gotten that one at the time.
A little fun fact, we actually live where there's the largest Walmart in the United States. There's two levels and it has an escalator that'll bring your cart up and down. So next I stopped into Kohl's to see what kind of spring and farmhouse decor that they had and I was shocked at how much Christmas stuff they still had. Um, a lot of it was 80% off clearance and I mean I'm just showing you a clip of a few things but they had every kind of decor and so much of it. The problem was I just wasn't looking for Christmas decor right now so I didn't get any. Kohl's had a very big selection of farmhouse and rustic picture frames. A lot of them were the rustic, um, raw looking wood and they were 50% off today. Thank you. 
Okay, so I just got back from um, Walmart and Kohl's, and I will have to say I was pretty impressed with Walmart's home decor selection. It, they've really stepped up their game, and they have a lot more stuff than I expected that they would have. So um, they had a decent size selection of throw pillows, and they did have some wooden wall decor, um, some you know regular shelf decor, so I was pretty impressed with what they had. And then of course they have the Pioneer Woman, you know, which is very farmhousey, um, really cute stuff. I did not get any of it. I don't need, I, you know, I'm trying to pare down. So she has a lot of like cute kitchen stuff and, and it's very colorful and bright. And I don't need it because I literally just hauled about three boxes out of my kitchen of stuff that I wasn't using anymore. So I didn't get any of it, but she does have a really nice selection and it's very bright and colorful. And I generally decorate with more neutrals, but then I'll just add a pop of color or two in my kitchen with like a hand towel or something. So, um, but it's really cute stuff if that's like the style that you like and if that, if you like those bright colors like that. So anyways, I only picked up a few things, but I wanted to give you guys an idea of what they had. So the first thing I got, and I got two of these, was, um, again, like I said, their select selection of throw pillows was pretty good. They um, are much more reasonably priced. I think that throw pillows can be so overpriced, and I don't like to go to TJ Maxx or Home Goods and spend $20. $25 on one pillow. I, it drives me crazy. I don't know why because I'll buy it. I'll pay for it with for something else, but just not for a pillow. So anyways, they had these gorgeous pillows and they are big and they're part of the, um, what is it? The Better Homes and Gardens. It's reversible. So this was by far my favorite thing I got. And I did get two of these. And I don't know if you can tell, it's like a charcoal gray color and um and cream so i got this and then this is the other side which i think is just adorable so i did get two of these because i just think so normally i don't like to buy any decor unless i already have in mind where i'm going to put this put something now this was an exception i did buy these two and i have uh, quite a few places i could put these so i don't have specifically i don't know exactly where i'm going to put them but they can either go on my sofa, they can go on my bed, they can go on my spare bed, they can go in my office, like in the corner, in a basket with like a throw blanket. So, I mean, I have many options of where I can put this. I just don't know specifically exactly yet where it's gonna go. But I got two of these and these were only, if I'm not mistaken, they were either $12.80 something cents or $12.96. So, so, so inexpensive for this big, very well-made, pillow. It's got this stitching along the edge. Um, anyways, I got two of these. I can't recommend these enough. These are big, nice pillows that would easily go for $20, $25 at TJ Maxx or Home Goods. So next I did get one more throw pillow. Um, I thought this was just so cute, kind of farmhousey. It's like that linen-y material, um, just says home in the like fleecy kind of material um i just think it's cute it's not too big not too small um this will probably definitely go on my sofa i have this sectional so it'll probably go like in the corner part or something um and this was eleven dollars and like 80 something cents it was 11 something so again i didn't think that was bad it's not of course as big as this pillow but it's more decorative and i just thought it was really cute for the price so another thing I got, um, I love these kind of like vases like this. So I got one of these. It kind of has like that distressed look to it. And I'll just put some kind of lamb's ear or eucalyptus or whatever. Uh, maybe some flowers in the spring and summer in this. I just think these are versatile and you can use them all the time. And this was 12 something as well, $12 and something cents as well. So I didn't think that was bad. It's pretty big. So I will find some place for this too. This most likely will go either in my master bedroom or in my guest bedroom that I'm going to kind of be redoing a little bit. So the last thing I got at Walmart, if you guys watched my um, decorate my master bedroom video 
on a budget. I needed king pillows because the pillow shams were king size and I didn't have king size pillows. So these pillows will hopefully fill out the shams that I got that goes with the bedding, the new bedding that I got for my master bedroom. So I just got the mainstays, allergy relief. We're not going to actually be using these. These are more for decoration. So I wasn't that picky about what we got. So that was everything that I got from Walmart. Um, again, they did have a lot of stuff. I just really didn't need any right now, but I wanted to give you guys an idea of some of the stuff they have in case you're looking. And then I went over to Kohl's and if you saw in some of those clips, Kohl's was like a disaster. First of all, they had so much um, Christmas stuff left. Like I've never seen any place have so much Christmas stuff left. They had, it was all like 80% off. So it was good prices. Okay, so, here's Kova. Yep, here she is. I just wasn't in the mood for, or in the market for Christmas stuff right now. So um, I didn't get any, but they did have a ton, a ton of Christmas stuff from like, I gave, showed you a couple clips, but that's not even a portion of what they had. They had every kind of decor left for Christmas. But anyways, they had a ton of stuff that was on clearance and I guess most of it was winter stuff and whatever. So, but it was like a mess. It was like big piles of stuff on the floor and you had to pick through it or whatever. But the only thing I did pick up was I got this rug and um, this will, pr and it was only on clearance for $6.99. So this will probably go in my, either in my kid's bathroom to put outside of the bathtub or I don't know, it's just, it's cream color. So it's kind of versatile. I can kind of put it anywhere that I need a little throw rug. So I thought for $6 and they actually have one more, they have one or two more and I might go back and get them because for six dollars you just really can't go wrong so most likely this will go in my um, kids bathroom to put just outside of their uh, bathtub so I hope you guys enjoyed this little mini haul and this shop with me at Walmart and Kohl's and uh, let me know if you guys like this type of video um, if you guys are new to my channel or, or if you're watching my videos for the first time hopefully you'll take some time to check my videos out and hopefully you like what you see and you'll subscribe um, but anyways, I uh, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Have a great day.